we have the Super Bowl in town, which is great, but that doesn't happen until Sunday. Outside of that, there really isn't, you know, much. Back in the day, I can remember a lot of times there being basketball games and, and hockey games and people going to them. I don't understand why they shut down this yeah, week. Does this, it make sense? This week, they didn't schedule a lot of the games here in town, which was kind of weird. It doesn't make sense, right? No, no, no. It doesn't, actually. You're going mean, to have a plethora of people in here with money. Man, have a game. And, and by the way, it's not really like you've got a concert every night in those places either, no. actually. I know Guns N' Roses is when? On Saturday, is it? It's either tomorrow night or Saturday. I think it is, right? Too expensive. I could not go to that one. Thank the Lord I've seen Guns N' Roses the last couple of... You know, it was, it was cheaper for me to drive up to Orlando and stay the night, go to Guns N' Roses, and, and then come down than it is to buy the ticket now at the AAA. I mean, when the just, Euchre seats are we running were, 250 and, Oh, yeah, and we were on the floor. We were like... 40, 40 rows away from the stage, and we had the cult opening up, which was awesome. Wow. Although, although here they added Snoop Dogg, which is pretty cool. Weird, because you go from Snoop Dogg to Guns N' Roses, which is kind of odd. Cool in the gang that. and Van Halen. That's about you yeah, know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. No, I'm with you there. Folks are chiming in, which we love you for. It's 72 Finns logo saying good morning. Flipside fishing, good morning. The draft seems like forever away. Flips, I don't think that because everybody said that about the NFL season. Oh, my Lord, we got to endure this whole Dolphin season. And it went by super fast, man. Man, that East, West, and, Mo and, the, and the Senior Bowl came up on us quick. Right, quick. We're already past that. So before you know it, next month we'll be at the Combine. And before you know it, the draft will be here. We'll be in Vegas. And we'll be ready to go. So don't worry about that. Don't blink don't, your eye, and it'll be here, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The good thing is, you know, the, the Dolphins have some time to prepare for all this stuff. So that's actually the important stuff. Uh, Dougie Fresh says, "Morning, fellas. Care to chime in about the NBA saying no to Kobe being the template for the NBA logo?" Dougie Fresh, you'll have to download that podcast because that was talked about yesterday on the show. So it's there. You can you can go and uh, download. It. That's the beauty of what we do now is we don't repeat things over and over again. But uh, we we addressed it all yesterday. I gave my thoughts on it. It's all there in the podcast. You can download it yesterday. We were on top of it. Don't worry about it. We're we're all over it. Uh, Flipside fishing says I'm getting anxious. Uh, go Gator says. Guys, the off season hasn't even started. A lot of time between now and the draft and. That's all right. We get to talk. We get to, you know, find out about things and players and things like that. Uh, Big O contacted Tommy Rockers yesterday. Tommy was not there, but Kyle, the GM, was. Kyle knows nothing. Yeah, Kyle, you, you can't talk to the other employees. Only Tommy knows about what we're doing, and you got to talk to the boss, okay? So the boss is the guy that's, uh, that's really in charge, not any of the other guys. Um, e e Emilio Nunez, good morning, boys, from Lafayette, Indiana. We'll see you soon, man. Come on down to uh, downtown Indianapolis. Lafayette, isn't that where all the windmills, that's right where the windmills are, right? They I have no They idea. have that big water tower. I know off. Palm Springs has all the windmills. N no, uh, coming back from Chicago, going through Indiana, I want to say that there's like the water tower, says Lafayette, and then that's where all the uh, power generator windmills are. I have no idea. But um, maybe you could give us a chime in. Maybe and see if I'm right. I think Emilio will tell you if you're right or wrong. I guess if he's uh, he is watching and listening. I seem to remember that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, he said he was working with Mark Angelo through you guys for the reservations. Uh, Mark's not handling reservations, and neither am I. It'll all be Tommy <laughs> Rockers. Okay, guys, gonna, we're not in charge of any of that stuff. You you're gotta, not taking placement of the tables and setting yeah, everything up like the yeah, wedding man. Yeah, yeah. We gotta, <laughs> we gotta, we gotta talk to, uh, we gotta talk to uh, Mark so he can get uh, Tommy in gear now, and people can start reserving because I think it's important for people to already start reserving, and it's it's good for. For them to already have, you know. Well, that way they could put the labor to the number. You know what yep. I mean? You can accommodate us properly. Take Dougie, care of us. Dougie Fresh says, you didn't have to get all dressed up for us, by the way. <laughs> yeah, no no concert shirt today. You know, you're right. 
I mean, are you going somewhere after the show? Yeah, 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 you yeah, got yeah, to look yeah, uh, the yeah, part? I, yeah, I've even got a long sleeve shirt in the car, too, on top of all of that. Oh, yeah. so you're going to even fancy up even more? Yeah, I'm going to a couple of places today. Are you I walking gotta, a runway, man, for some modeling agency or something? Is well, that, that, that going on? definitely is not going to happen okay, well, anytime I... soon <laughs> or ever or forget it any chance in my life. Ah, you could dream. Uh, I could dream. Yeah, dreaming is free, as uh, Blondie would say. There's no doubt about that. Uh, we got a loaded uh, program for you today. We got a bunch of uh, guests for you uh, on the show. Uh, we will have uh, at 11.30, I'm sorry, at noon, Brian Edwards. Uh, we, that'll be our Hialeah Park handicapping investment segment. So we'll, get, uh, we'll talk all kinds of uh, props for the Super Bowl. We'll get his thoughts on the Super Bowl Anything else that he wants to bet on, a roach race, anything. Uh, Dan Stubbs, the former Miami Hurricane great. Uh, we'll get uh, Danny on. Uh, he's a buddy and a friend for a long time. Always kind enough to uh, join us on the program. So we'll get his thoughts on the Canes. And remember, Dan Stubbs was drafted by who? The San Francisco 49ers. And I, last time I checked, I think they're in the Super Bowl. So... We'll talk to Dan about that. He, you know, he also played for, you know, the uh, Dolphins too, but and a slew of other teams. Hometown guy. Yeah, yeah. So we'll talk to Dan, and we'll get his thoughts on the Canes, and we'll get his uh, prediction on the Super Bowl. Uh, Evan Silva, uh, owner and uh, and covers the NFL for EstablishTheRun.com. So we'll have a little fun with uh, Evan there. We'll uh, we'll talk all things Super Bowl. Uh, with Evan, so we'll have a little fun there. So we got uh, several guests for you here on the program, so we can have a a little fun and talk a little sports. Obviously, I've got on my own tons of topics uh, that I want to uh, get into. Uh, once uh, Eric uh, is is asking, where's our buddy Joe? Let's trade for Richard Sherman. Uh, Eric, I have no idea what the hell you're talking about with where's our buddy Joe. Don't know what that means, and then let's trade for Richard Sherman. I don't know. I don't know what the – are you, like, talking to somebody else on the chat board, not us? Because I have no idea what you're smoking or saying. At his One age, J- Richard's got to come with a discounted price, yeah. correct? Uh, no, I'm just – I don't even know what that, <laughs> why you would even bring that up. I have no idea why anybody would even trade for Richard Sherman at this point in time. He's fine where he's at right now. I think he's in the Super Bowl. He's got a shot at winning another title. I think he's, I, I think he's, you know, perfectly fine where he's at. But uh, you know, whatever that is on the uh, chat board, we at least we thank you for watching and listening, Joe. That's what we thank you for. Uh, that is. Uh, don't forget, but a thumbs a up, please. Thumbs yeah. up. All right. Uh, you called out Joe for wanting Dolphins to do stupid things. Like uh, like who? What Joe? Are you talking about Rose? Oh, if it's Rose, yeah, no, well, I mean, that kind of is a tradition for me calling Joe out for a lot of stupid things that he would say about the Dolphins. I mean, that's normal. That's, you know, it's like uh, Indomitian Sioux or that Fasano's the number one tight end or whatever. Yeah, no, I'm... Is that like you breathing? Like, like you breathing? Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, <laughs> uh, I mean, that that's... That's an old, tired story there. I don't even know why you, you bring that up, but whatever. Uh, I played college football with Stubbs' nephew or cousins. Can't remember their relation. Okay. We will, uh, we will talk to Dan Stubbs at 2 o'clock. We'll have a little fun uh, with Dan uh, here on the program. We've got a lot of things to uh, actually talk about with him here uh, on the show. If you want to get in, of course... Uh, you can get in on the AccidentLawFirm.com text line, which is 786-322-1105. That's 786-322-1105. If you want to get in on the program, you can also reach out to us on Twitter. That's at Big O Show. Follow us there, as always, at uh, Big O Show. And, of course, uh, make sure you support us on YouTube at Big O Radio Show and on uh, Instagram also, Big O Radio Show. And remember, you can uh, subscribe to the podcast just in case you're watching. You can subscribe to the audio podcast, uh, which is thoroughly broken down by my partner in crime here uh, in Bill. 
uh, at uh, Big O Radio Show on Spotify, Stitcher, iTunes, Google Play, and SoundCloud. All of those are there for you, so all the platforms that you can listen to us. Big O, what concert did you get that shirt from? Uh, this one I got it. <laughs> I got it from the uh, from the Ralph Lauren's. Oh, you know what? You went to Boca. I, Did you do some of the uh, polo games? Yes. And that's where you got that yes. from. One of the polo matches. Yes, I went to. I did a little polo, a little polo, you know. And everybody was watching me drinking a cup with their uh, pinkies up, sipping, and yes, very ooh la la. So I figured shirt and you know be. NorCal says wake and bake. Uh, NorCal, uh, you need to call Tommy Rockers because people are contacting us here and all over, and they want to reserve. So they keep asking, what was it, Lyle or somebody else that was there, and they had no idea what they're doing. So we need to talk to Tommy Rockers and need him to start taking reservations because people are ready to reserve already, So, which is smart, by the way, because it's three days, and you want to reserve your table for one, two, or three days out there with us. And have some fun. So, yeah, I mean, I, I don't blame you if you want. Hey, we reserved our plane tickets already to go to Oakland and then go to Las Vegas. We reserved our tickets, right, to go to the Pearl Jam concert, right, that kind of stuff. So we got to do the same thing for everything else. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, we got we to gotta get, uh, get Tommy in gear here so we can uh, – we got people in demand which is a beautiful thing for Tommy Rockers. Love that. I can't wait to be hanging out with you guys for three days. It's awesome. And again, on the accidentlawfirm.com text line, we have Nora chiming in to say, happy to say, since then, I have helped families in so many ways in the process of closing their homes. Wanted to ask you, are you ready to come to an agreement with me and pay cash for your property? And keep asking. <laughs> Here, I got something for them in NorCal. <laughs> oh, man. I, 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 it's funny how they... You're not even selling anything, but they want you to sell something that you're not selling. It's kind of weird. It's just odd. You know what I'm saying? It's just odd. It just is. NorCal says, I'm on it. We will have it locked down real soon. So there you go. Uh, hey, not Cal. Kyle said you guys are handling reservations for a count on people. Kyle said they are preparing and would be ready. Well, we're not doing anything. Okay, they're doing it. We're, we're showing up. Yeah, we're showing up for the podcast. Our show, That's it. We don't, we're, we're not plugging in the, in the things, hooking up the mics. Yeah, we're not in the restaurant business, dude. Okay, we got enough things that we're trying to balance. Okay, like right now, I feel like the dude on a unicycle juggling, and then at the same time, I'm balancing crap on my head, plates and stuff. Yeah, I, that's what I feel like right now, trying to juggle everything I'm trying to juggle in my world at this point in time. There is no way that I'm also going to try to juggle any kind of reservations for anything or or Bill. We got no. Used to do the bar and restaurant business. No. Got out of that. Thank you. Bye bye. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah. We're not. 